Hello, Dicers. Welcome back to Dice Decides. I mean, we are back. <laughs> Let's just roll the dice and then we'll find out what game it is we'll play. So uh, let's just do it. Okay, what is it gonna be? Oh, I already dropped it, okay. <laughs> the Forgotten City, all right, here we go. Okay, I'm back and I'm already being whispered to. <laughs> How kinky. <laughs> the statue's leap of faith. No, oh, I almost jumped on accident. Oh, I was not ready for that. Let's have a look around here. Hmm. Nothing. Yes, I can hear you. I'm not jumping. Stupid voice. I'm not killing myself. I just started this game. Freaking voices in my head trying to <laughs> tell me to kill myself. What is this place? Gorgeous, man. Gorgeous. All right, let's check this place out. I'm your best behavior, I trust. Greetings, of course. citizen. My name's Horatius. Magistrate Sentius asked me to escort you to him personally. Follow me, please. All right, lead the way. Follow me. <laughs> the only thing you really need to understand right now is the golden rule. Let me see if I can explain it this way. All right, I want to know. I was serving in the Legion. If there was a mutiny brewing in one cohort, the legate in charge it wouldn't waste time finding the bad apples among hundreds. They just divided us into groups of ten, made us draw straws, and whoever drew the short straw had to be executed by the other nine. That Didn't sounds fun. They had done anything wrong. One of us in ten would die for the crimes of the collective. We call it decimation. Decimation. That seems like rough justice to you. Kind of. For a rude shock. Uh oh. Because the golden rule is exactly ten times worse. I don't think I want to know now. The rest. He's up these stairs. I don't think I want to know. It sounds bad. Oh, another one fresh out of the baths. I take it. Uh, I haven't been to a bath. Oh, I wish Horatius would stop letting barbarians in here. What do you want? Yeah, I'll be going, I whatever. Trust you can see yourself out. Yeah, let's uh, go up and actually find out about this golden rule. But I want some bread. It looks delicious. <laughs> some apples. More bread. This is cozy. Oh, oh, don't mind me. I just live here. Oh. What a nice place to live. Mosaics. Just that view. All right, let's wait. Who's that? Wait, that is him. I'm supposed to talk to him. <laughs> We're finally alone. I assume you already know who I am. May I know your name? <laughs> I'm Dice D. Check out my SoundCloud. <laughs> a curious name to match a curious accent. But I digress. Something about your demeanor gives me the urge to caution you against doing anything, shall we say, unlawful while you're here. Is that understood? Yes. Now, you're probably wondering why I summoned you, and I'll get to that. But first, take a look at this wondrous place. It's amazing, dude. A secret city built deep in the mountains. <laughs> I just want to get out of here. No, it's beautiful. It's Indeed. A, it's More great. importantly, consider the miraculous community we've built here over the last seven months. Twenty-two complete strangers brought together by the fates, living and working together in our own little paradise. <laughs> and in all that time, not a single sin has been committed. No he fights, probably doesn't know about the suicide. <laughs> If even one person commits a sin here, every last one of us uh -oh. will die. You see, the builders of this place, whoever they were, left inscriptions warning, 
The many shall suffer for oh. the sins of the one. Uh oh. What we can gather, breaking the law here, will anger the gods. I better not tell them about the suicide. <laughs> punishment, like the curses of Medusa and Midas combined, Jeez. turning us all to gold. Oh, that's hard to break it to you. That's gonna happen. <laughs> It's extraordinary that we've survived as long ah, as Ah, that's why it's called the golden day, rule. I, I get it now. More afraid that our time in the sun is almost up. Okay. And now it seems that day is finally here. What? All that matters is that somebody in this city is about to break the golden rule. Why else would Proserpina send you now? Unless mm. you and I can stop them, our doom is assured. I know that's a lot to take in, and you look like you have questions. Please, ask away. <laughs> um, what do we ask? Yeah, what counts as a sin? An intelligent question. There was a good deal of debate about that in our first weeks here. Does it refer to crimes, or to some other ill-defined wrong? Of course, everyone agrees on the basics. No theft, no assault, and certainly no murder. But beyond that, it was more difficult to reach a consensus. What about lying, insulting someone, blasphemy, trespass, trying to escape, bribery, infidelity, uh, suicide? Oh. <laughs> As magistrate, I had to exercise leadership, and so I made a decision. We must uphold the laws of the Empire to a standard never before seen. And we must honor the peace of the gods, the sacred accord between the gods and the people of Rome. It is only by offering the gods the proper respect that we may prosper as Rome has for centuries. See ya, bro. Note? Sentia to Sentius and Sentia. May Clementia give you the strength to forgive me. I am sorry to have to leave you this way, but I have found a way to escape and I must take it. I hope we meet again someday. Okay. I was gonna go up here, then he just left. Quite a nice place. This view is good. Let's go up here. Lovely town. Well, I guess we're gonna do the quest. If we go, oh, whoa. <laughs> I'm a ballerina! Woo! <laughs> Hello? Alright, Shrine of Apollo is over there. Ave. See it, bro. Oh. Ave to you as well. <laughs> Ave Maria. <laughs> He's been doing push ups this whole time. You are strong, man. I think he missed leg day though. <laughs> Dang, it's gotta be hard to do those push ups with that heavy helmet. Whoa. What were you two talking about? <laughs> Sorry, what? Don't play dumb. <laughs> I saw you. Having a shady little chat with old man Sentius up on his balcony. Shady. He's making a last ditch effort to pick up votes by talking to a woman. He's even more senile than I thought. What? Everyone knows women can't vote. No, not election. What though. else would you be murmuring about on election day? Mark my words, Maliolus is going to be magistrate by the end of the day. <laughs> and if I tell him you've sided with that feeble old has been, that you've been trying to undermine his hard won victory, you'll have picked the wrong patron. Got it? Bro, I don't care. <laughs> Good. Then stay out of it. Nobody likes Caput Murde foreigners interfering in an election. Great. Thanks for the warm welcome. It'll be good. Keep doing your push-ups, bro. 
<laughs> do, 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 do. Alright, this is where we want to be. Very cozy place. Alright, in we go. Push! Push! Lucretia! She okay? She dying? What are you doing in here? Can't you see this woman is dying? She She's is, oh my god. She oh needs no. the resin of a plant called Silphium, but that coolas cumulatus decius won't give it to me. What? I wish I could help. It's too late. She just slipped she away. She just died. <laughs> what happened? She was poisoned. She came in here frothing at the mouth. Normally, I'd treat her with resin of silphium, a rare plant which is perfect for this sort of thing. And I knew Dacius had some at his market stall, right around the corner. So I ran over there, but he just looks at me with this evil smile and says, That'll be a thousand in Ari. Thousand? There was no way I could afford that, <laughs> but he knew it. Then oh. that toad shrugs and says, Supply and demand. I guess you don't value your friend's life that highly. Get me that Silphium resin. I'm going to have another patient in here soon. Could be in the next day or in the next hour. And I will not allow this to happen again. I don't care how you get it, but you have to make it happen. Because if I lose another patient <laughs> this way, I swear to the gods below, not even the golden rule will stop me from marching up to that genetic comfortuto and scratching his eyes out. Jeez. Alrighty then. Uh, yeah, I'll see what I can do. I'll be going now. Well, come back if you get sick or injured. Day or night, I'll do what I can. Ooh, where do I even find that resin? He'll be like, oh, found it. Oh, well, she just died. That was quick. Came in at the wrong time. Didn't I? Decius. You. Salve, stranger. And welcome to our idyllic little slice of the empire. Nice haircut, bro. Look, we have the same haircut now. <laughs> oh, yeah, I need some resin. Certainly. All I ask is a reasonable price of a thousand denarii. Of course. <laughs> Your price gouging over life-saving medicine. What is wrong with you? Oh, it's perfectly legal. Simply a question of supply and demand, I'm afraid. Take it or leave it. <laughs> Take it. What? Hear what? That whisper. Ah, uh, you sure you're feeling all right? Oh God. If you're hearing things, perhaps you should pay a visit to Lucretia's clinic. Oh no. <laughs> Don't want another navy on our hands. She claimed the statue was a whispering to her. Nobody else could hear it. Why am I going crazy? The palace and we never heard from her again. But I digress. Do you want this Sylphium or not? That's hardly my concern. But if you get a job, work hard and save your coins, you should be able to afford it within, say, five years? Five years? This is not even worth it. How about I just take it well, instead? if you did that, you'd break the golden rule. And we'd share <laughs> the same fate as the last lot who lived here. Oh yeah. Is that what you want? You're the one breaking it by making people die because of your cost. Is that what you want? If not, hand them over now. Yeah, whatever. We agree on something. Heck yeah. Now, do you want to make a purchase? No, I'm good. Very well. Perhaps I can interest you in something within your budget. Oh, really? Wait, I'm supposed to steal? That's part of the quest? <laughs> Very well. Another time. Wait a second. Steal the resin from Decius's stall. There's no way Decius is going to sell me the Sylphium. Sylphium. Okay. Oh, it's over there. How'd you do? But he is looking right at me. Can't just do that. Um. What if I crouch? Am 
my head now. Hey Virgil, how much would you want to make me a bow? For the last time, Dacius, I'm not making you a bow. But why? You know why. But how am I going to defend myself against someone else with a weapon? There are no other weapons in the city. <laughs> we all went along with the magistrate's weapons ban, so it wouldn't be an issue. That's why I've got to get in first before someone else beats me to it. <sighs> Gosh, these conversations. How am I so wait, is he leaving now? Can I steal? No, he's still- I can't, I can't steal in front of him. Do I have different quests? Mangle, the golden rule. Figure out who is most likely to break the golden rule. Uh, okay. How do I do that? How can I get a bow? Oh! You have to do something! What are you doing? A man arrived in the baths. A real nasty sort, with his face all covered up. And he's got a weapon. You have to do something, or he's gonna break the golden rule. Wait, is that Karen? Wait a minute. Abia, but now's not the time. Are you going to help or not? She looks like Karen. <laughs> um, I don't have a weapon. None of us do. The magistrate made us throw them all into the chasm. So now this man's bow is the only one in the city. You'll just have to improvise. Um, I'll see what I can do. Thank you. He's still in there somewhere. I have to hide. Find me in this empty shrine when it's over. <laughs> no. What? We don't have time for this. I have to go. Why do I keep listening to the whispers? Ugh. <laughs> Ugh. Okay. The shrine is collapsing. Oh, what the? Oh. What? What the heck just happened? Fabia, no! Karen, oh, <laughs> no, God. not Karen. Did anyone see that? The whole train just collapsed. Oh, bread. Oh, Fabia, why did you have to go in there? Poor yeah, right. Sweet girl. Shrine may collapse at any moment. Why did she do this? Damn. Freaking hell. Well, I don't think that was suicide. It just kind of happened. Anything here? Whoa, what is this? Whoa. Spooky tunnel. Still have a flashlight. <laughs> I wonder if I show this flashlight to someone who they think I'm from the future. Running through the tunnel. Ooh, what do? Oh, what is this place? What a cave. What's up, bro? A visitor. Indeed. Welcome, welcome. Dice D. It's a sincere pleasure to meet you. Tell me, what brings you all the way down here? Kind of accident, yeah. Then perhaps the fates brought you here to learn the secrets of this place. I will tell you everything I know, but first, a request. I have been living down here alone for many years, with nobody to talk to but myself. The one okay. thing I long for above all else before I die is a good philosophical argument with somebody astute. Philosophical and argument. That person is you. Let all us right. find out with this simple question. Have you deduced the name of the god responsible for the golden rule? The god? Uh no. Hmm. You have much to learn. It's best if you figure it out on your own. Come back once you've made progress. Hmm.
fair enough. Hanging fish. The nutrients in these fish must have helped the old man compensate for the lack of sunlight. Jeez. Yeah, how do you survive without vitamin D? I guess it is in fish. Uh, but still. Damn. Okay. Oh. Ah, you've returned. I never laughed, bro. <laughs> this is pretty. I like that. I said the water looked a little unrealistic, but it's not bad. It's not bad. I do like it, actually. The reflection is really cool. It's a very nice game. What is this? Looks like a secret. Ooh. It's locked. What is he hiding? I mean, it's a pretty chill place to... Ah, you've returned. Come on, bro. Plague? Greek plague, but the translation, the many shall suffer for the sins of the one. Oh, God. That's the huh? quote. What do we have here? Oh, wait. That was just a shortcut to where I came from. <laughs> Man. Um, how am I supposed to find who's going to break the golden rule? That's, that seems like such a complicated quest. I know my hand. Oh. <laughs> Alright. I have to go again. I have to crouch. Why has he been there so long? It's not even a long way to get out. Weird. Okay. Can I take the resin now? She'll try to help me. Ooh. He's still kind of there, though. This is... Is this the moment? I don't know. He's still there. This is closed. Can I go here? Hello? Can I move this? I can't. Let me in, statue! Ooh, it's a skeleton! What? Why can't I move this? Oh, what? Just another statue. Oh! <gasps> Found tons of monies! Bottle of wine. Possibly the last bottle of wine in the city. I'll take it. He watches? Good thing I have a flashlight. A note. You can read that if you want. I just want to explore. Wait, it goes down? Ooh. Hello, guys. Anyone here? This is a big tunnel. Oh, uh, the leaves here. All right. Okay, um, right, I think I'll end it here, uh, this was interesting, I have gotten quite a few quests now, uh, a lot of leads, so I guess I'll have stuff to do, and I found a bit of money now, I have 113 coins, hickeys, <laughs> I still have a flashlight, alright guys, uh, that's it for now, uh, so remember to gently tap on that like button and ring that bell so you don't miss an upload. And thanks for watching, Dicers. Hope you have a fantastic rest of your day, and I will see you next time.